Hello everyone in YouTube land. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you have a fantastic Sunday. That's right, Sunday. I'm changing back to Sunday as the day of releasing new episodes. Uh, just because. Uh, it suits me better to do it this way, I think. So, uh, yeah, it's nice to change it up a little bit now and then, you know. So, um, yeah, I hope you have a fantastic Sunday. Today will be a news episode. Uh, like I told you last episode. Uh, yeah, I'm trying out different things. Um, uh, now and then I'm taking uh, the pleasure of uh, talking about my favorite albums uh, over the years. And uh, it's uh, been a few years uh, uh, for me uh, enjoying the metal scene. So... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, we have uh, a lot of uh, great albums to talk about. But um, anyways, let's head over to the news. Death Metal Veterans Deicide uh, has announced a new album. And they have released a new album single uh, called Sever the Tongue and uh, I get a great good old deicide vibe from this uh, single. It reminds me of the song um, Oblivious to Evil uh, from the I think it was the second deicide album uh, and it sounds great. Amazing. Uh, I've been a fan of Deicide for many years now. Uh, I remember uh, back in the old days <laughs> when I uh, was starting uh, to listen to death metal and stuff. Uh, I think Deicide was one of the scariest bands that I have uh, had ever heard back then. And uh, yeah, they have released a lot of albums. And uh, Deicide, they have uh, yeah their own take on death metal, uh, if you know what I mean. Uh, they yeah they have uh, kind of their own style, I would say. And uh, yeah, uh, they have been in the game for many many years. So. Go and check it out. Links below. And now, Judas Priest. Yeah, you heard me. Judas Priest um, have a new album coming out called Invincible Shield and is due to arrive uh, on the 8th of March. Uh, I don't know if you have heard the three singles that they have released from the upcoming album but uh, if you haven't go and check it out at once um, uh, the first song that they released uh, the single was uh, Panic Attack and it's an amazing song I got a real good old uh, Judas Priest vibe um, yeah ram it down painkiller uh, but uh, this song, Panic Attack, uh, in my opinion, uh, this is the album that uh, should have arrived after Painkiller. <laughs> so, amazing song. Uh, and, um, yeah, and they have another song called uh, Trial by Fire out as well, single. And uh, the third single that they released was uh, Crown of Horns. And you need to go and check it out. Um, yeah. Judas Priest. 
what can I say? These veterans, they... Yeah. They keep on going. And as I have talked about before on this channel, I think it's really inspiring uh, that they do so. Uh, and why the hell shouldn't they? This is what they do. Music. So, and for us, the fans, keep it on coming, Judas Priest. We are ready for you. And the last piece of news in this episode. Uh, I discovered a band recently uh, called Ulder. Uh, it's a black metal band, uh, a one-man band, a woman that uh, makes the music. And uh, we are talking about great black metal. Uh, heavy guitars, loads of atmosphere, and uh, yeah, it reminds me of the uh, uh, earlier releases from Dimmu Borgir, uh, Covenant, Satyricon, and Hulder has a new album out right now called Verses in Oath, and uh, you need to go and check it out. Great album, great music. I think you will really enjoy it if you like uh, old school Dimmuborger Covenant and so on. I think you are in for a treat. So uh, go and check it out. That's all the news that I had for this episode. So uh, check back Sunday next episode in 14 days and uh, we will see what I uh, do in that episode I hope you have a fantastic Sunday and I hope to see you next time stay metal everyone